For decades, this incredible underwater landscape has been the focus of study for Martin Welly, a marine scientist and conservationist. He's working to protect this diverse region. It's home to 75% of the world's coral species, 3,000 different kinds of fish, and a host of other unique marine life. The coral reef actually is the home for fish, nursery ground for fish, feeding ground for fish. Coral reef is like shelter in the desert. But climate change is warming the oceans, causing mass cases of coral bleaching and die-off around the globe. Well, he fears this year's El Nino, however small, will further warm the waters and take reefs another step closer to extinction. If your coral reef disappear, then fish also will disappear from that area. There are other threats to the coral. Angelique Batuna, a dive resort operator, has been battling an iron ore mine that has set up shop near pristine coral shoals. Protests last year by villagers turned violent, with rocks being thrown. The mines protected by local officials. Authorities, we're told, have been very aggressive in keeping divers away from their operations. So what we're going to do is we're going to dive in here, swim over as close as we can get to the jetty underwater. The visibility is so poor, it's all we can do to stay together. And when we find the reef, it's covered in layers of thick silt. Even the visible patches are choking. After only a few minutes, we surface. How was the coral here before? It was really beautiful, healthy reef, lots of colors, lots of fish. And now, I mean, it's nothing. But not all is lost. Welly's research has found that climate change isn't having as big an impact on coral here. That's because the Triangle's reefs lie close to deeper, colder water. So to protect them from human destruction, Welly has formed community teams to guard the Triangle's reefs. I'm confident that uh, if we do something, if we protect this coral reef, the coral reef will, will be still exist. Life resources of the people still exist. People still can eat for tomorrow and in, in the future. And with the way currents carry coral throughout the oceans, Welly believes preserving this underwater paradise could ultimately save reefs worldwide. Steve Chow, Al Jazeera, in the Coral Triangle.